Mm. Ah, right. Come on, Sarah. We need to get out of here fast. Mm. Why? What's happening, Doctor? We we had to, we had to move fast. The ice warriors are after us. The ice warriors? Yes, we met with a ball from Peladon, Sarah. Since since our business with the Federation, we had to get, get we had to get away from them fast. I'm over the time vortex. What's to tell the Brigadier? Tell Brig tell the Brigadier Christmas dinner is cancelled. The Doctor has been located. Now we must destroy him. Fire weapon. It's all right, Sarah. I got you. Ah, yeah. ah, the, so the ice wars they're firing us. We have to get with them fast as I can. Mm. Ah. Sarah? Sarah! Mm. A time field? It's a gateway from, from the vortex. If it don't it return to the now, I'll be, I'll be frozen in, in the TARDIS forever. For uh, including me. Oh no. Oh, I believe it's the end. Good luck, Sarah. Goodbye, Brigadier. Good luck, my dears. Hey, can you get off my scarf? Oh, I'm so I'm sorry I stabbed you in the scarf. What? No? Oh, I think you were never me, nice Tarbis. Well, no, yeah, you should clean it up and make it right again. So, tell me. Would you like a jelly, baby? What? Again, are you another me or just a, a time another time lord who has his own tarbis? Oh, you just brilliant. Well, it could be wrong though, because the whole universe about the, the, the vortex about the three five minutes, but you just well, you just you just just brilliant. The most famous regeneration I ever experienced. You didn't answer my question. Hmm? <sighs> I said, what, are you another me? Or are you just a, 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 a time lord? Oh, yes, well, yeah, one question, well, yeah, I'm you from your future, and this, well, this is my TARDIS, well, your TARDIS, I think, well, yes, apparently so, but look at you, look at you, I, I haven't seen that generation for, well, I, I met, I did quite over 11, my 11th and my 10th and my, my 9th and then my 5th and all that, that, all that, but not even you, oh, this is my Christmas list, yeah, yeah, have you got a Christmas list? No, no, you don't mean to, that. Oh, look at you! I, it's all, like, so, so... Fantastic! Mind you, it's more, it's more saggy, the more the curly a little bit. Uh, but there's a thing, I mean, I think. It's probably, it must be the light infection. Probably, I'll probably get, get it fixed and somebody I'll get you back home, home wherever you get, how'd you got here? But how do you actually go here? But we're in the time vortex! We're, we're, I was flying! How can you actually come here? No, no incarnation will come in the vortex. Unless... Unless you must go through a time gap! Oh, great, great, yeah, oh, yes, great, 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 yeah. Because your, your my incarnation are, are really just making me, making me in the naughty list. And now, I think it's time we must take it back home. Well, okay, um, what you came from? Um, 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 I think, was it this since, well, look at your clothes. I think it's, uh, somewhere near 1975 or 1976. I don't know. But anyway, that, look at you. The, most, the, the cowl and the scarf and the curly hair and the... Oh, have you got jelly babies? Mind you, I like the orange ones. I mean, apparently they're, 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 they're greener. No, it's a piece either. Are you done? Uh, yes, I am. You were saying? Well, and now you've been talking, I think it's time you must take me have back my own TARDIS. Your TARDIS? Yes. Oh, I see. Right, let's take it back home. Well, oh, anyway, anyway, I, I just want to know where you came from. 
Where, where, where are you now? Hmm? The, the Ark in space? The, 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 the uh, Scaro, the Daleks have began, and, or Volker, Zygons, or, all that funny hat with, with, with the Crinoids, or, or the hand of fear. Oh, you don't remember that, we can mention that now. Well, when I came from was 1976. Oh yeah, you must be with Sarah now. How Sarah Jane Smith? Oh yeah, uh, come uh, think of it. I know, now we've met, never met Sarah Jane. Anyway, now uh, we can take it back home. <coughs> what? <coughs> What's wrong? <coughs> it's hard to take it back home, but we're in your TARDIS. But this is not my TARDIS. I, put, I tried to make a station lever. Let's see if that works. And that doesn't work too. Unless... Uh, Doctor, I think we found your TARDIS. Take a look. Ah, here you are, girl. Wait, wait a minute. Ah, uh, yes, I see. That's just not what I expected. Looks like your two TARDIS are, uh, uh, are both together. Means it means if we step out, it will be your TARDIS. And once I step out, it will be your TARDIS. But I, but I believe but I believe both two TARDIS are stuck together. You remember we, did, we, we, we went through that since, since, we, since we, we, with the Master, when he, when he trapped us in the void with Kronos. Anyway, what, you went through a time gap. What made you go through the time gap? I don't know, Doctor. I was I was at my TARDIS with Sarah Jane. We were chasing about the Ice Warriors. The Ice Warriors? Why the Ice Warriors after you? But they were the most Martians in the universe, like Mars. I mean, I mean, what? Why are they after you anyway? Why? Well, it's a long story. It happened eight hours ago. Oh, what? I'm listening. Well, apparently, Doctor, when I was. When I was at Chris, when it was, when it was Christmas, two thousand, I mean nineteen seventy six. I was at, I was at with Sarah Jane. We were about to go to Christmas dinner with with, with the Brigadier, but Sarah doesn't want to leave. So I, so I ha so I took her somewhere in Christmas ca called the Eye of Orion. Ah, here we are, sir. The Eye of Orion, just as I promised you. It's beautiful. Look at all these Christmas decorations, Doctor. Yes, I see. Anyway, there's, there's some, uh, lo lots of lights around here. Yes, I think so. Oh, do you mind if I look around and you can know where you always do, Doctor? Yes, need so. Be back here in 15 minutes. <laughs> Set it up. Ah, hello! I'm the doctor, and uh, and probably knows my friend was with me because he's looking to look around somewhere in the Orion. He just want to give a, a nice Christmas. You are the doctor. Yes, I am, and you must be a nice warrior. I met you kind once from from Peladon and Earth and Future Earth. So tell me, Ice Warrior, why are you here? Follow me, then I'll show you. All right, all right. Anyway, it's Christmas. So where's your Christmas spirit? Constable Barrow, I have a present. I have found someone. No, I'm in a busy moment. I, I'm busy decorating the Christmas tree. Did you say his name? But sir, it is the doctor. What? The Doctor? Ah, hello, Cousin Mamaro! Doctor, I, I haven't seen you Wait, are you sure you're the Doctor? Of course I am! Look, you, you can't be! Well, the last time I saw you were, uh, old fellow with white hair. Yes. Well, apparently I did. F three times. I've regenerated. Oh, yes, I see. Well, at least you're here now. It's good to see you, Doctor. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you, Doctor. Cousin Mamaro. Anyway, now, 
You may tell me what, why the ice wars are here. You know these uh, species looking for planets so they can uh, take over. So they can be Martians. Oh yes. Well, follow me. The meeting's starting. What meeting? I'll explain the way. Come on, uh, uh, Commander Asuka. Greetings, everyone. Sea Devils, Levine. I've given you, um, the Ice Warriors, a great gift. A gift they have lost from Mars many years ago. Ever since their planet was frozen in ice, they have found ways to d d bring their race back. They have this technology. They call it the Artifact. This artifact, it will melt every single ice where the ice wars were melt were frozen to ice for years. As the ice wars agreed me, I should advantage to give them the artifact. For the reason why they brought in the Eye of Orion, because they have no way to use it if it's dangerous. The, when, once the artifact launches right over Mars in the Earth's core, in the Mar Mars's core, it will it will rate and, and, and melt every single ice war is melted and Mars will live again so are we all in agreement? Uh, excuse me oh yes sorry I didn't even forget yes, myself this is the doctor a, a time lord have we made this fence yes I, I hope you didn't mention my species anyway now can I say something of course as, as you said about the, the uh, weapon it, it may it may just work, but you said about 84% of the uh, of Mars's core. But if 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 that launch over your uh, the ice world's uh, uh, planet's core, it, it will melt the whole world, the, the whole planet. It can rip the whole uh, uh, the uh, uh, planet apart. That's ridiculous. You don't know that. I do, because I because I know about artifacts like that, and they don't melt planets like this. But Doctor, this is the only way I should give Mars and the Ice Words a chance. A chance they'll be free. To free from their, from their, from ice, from Mars, from thousands of years. Yes, I know. But I know what, how they've done in the last, twice. But I, no, but it doesn't mean that they can do it on their own. We must survive. The warriors must survive. We must, we may have traveled planets to planets to destroy and... Turn Mars. Yeah, like Earth, or future Earth, and Paradon. You failed three times then, but if, but I was there. I was there when you failed. But the, but doesn't mean I, I, I'm trying to stop you. I'm trying to help you to stop your the, the destruction of Earth. I'm trying to stop the, a, a catastrophe. You, I know what you're doing. You're trying to stop us having the artifact, but this won't help. I, we must. Survive. Look, I know. The Ice Wars failed three times, and and failed their home planet thousands of years. I know, but Mars needs to be frozen. It's always been frozen. You're the Ice Wars. Ever since Mars was turned cold, you have ideas to, to give you suits to, to to keep yourself warm. But these suits, we want to be, we want to be free. We want uh, uh, the, the Mars to be. To be furious. Yes, I know. So, Doctor, shall we continue? No, I'm not letting you take the artifact, uh, Constable Mara. Do not give them the ice words. Look, I'm sorry, Doctor. My agreement is on. It's off. So, do we all agreement? As the reptilians of Earth. Of the of the Rexic uh, Consul of the Rexicological Palavatorius. I I agree. You see, Doctor? We must give the, the Ice Wars the artifact. It's all yous. It's all yours, Ca Commander Scalia. Well, is there one thing I can say to you, Commander Scalia? And what is that? Because I'm gonna take it. Ice! You must be destroyed! <laughs> what happened? The doctor took the artifact! The, 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 get after him! You must stop! Oh, why not? 
Give us the artifact, you put it in the machine. Take, give it back. Sorry, I had to save your your life, and I'm sorry about this. What? <laughs> you see, uh, what? Well, why? Why? Why is it hot? I I put I took the I temperature the heater the heating means it means your your the whole room is it is on it's in hot you can't desert, you can't stand the heat so bye bye mm. come on sir we need to go now why what happened oh it's fine later come on let's go mm. you idiot I'm sorry doctor I have to I have to stop the ice wars and uh, saving the home planet from destruction well thanks to you now you. They shot you down, and then and then they're gonna make uh, get, make you through a time gate gap, and now and, and stop with you now. Two Tardises both to get together. If I can't leave, if I don't leave, that means it will be the whole universe in destruction. Anyway, what happened to the Ice Wars when they when they were they when they when they're trying to stop when they were trying to stop you from escaping? Well, well, I, I don't know. When I went through the time gap, that's the last time I see them. The, Yes, the time, the time wave, the, 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 the last must have, must have made you go through time gate, gap. We don't, we can't, uh, we can't uh, break that gap. If we do, two TARDIS will blow up each other. If, if you die, I'll never become the Doctor. I, that's, I'll never become you. So what now then? Well, now we have to find out how we get to uh, start passing the gap, time gap. At, Gap, and then and then we can go find them find the ice words and stop them but what could we do well we could just find some other way anyway you remember we, we, we remember we win the master because I got I can't remember because I got so many lives and years but it's always bugging me and giving me a headache well the last time we were in the time room we were with the master we got to Kronos uh, we, we Joe Joe pressed the the emergency temporal uh, uh, starter. Time ram. Of course. What is it? We can use time ram. No, that's not. No, no, that's that, no, that, that's impossible. We can't do that. But two, you know what happens? Two Dardises in the same timeline. If we, if we break these, if we use the time ram, we can, we can, we will vaporize all two Dardises in, in the time loop. And then, yeah, I know what happens then. We'll be obliterated. From from his from everything. We can't do that. That's dangerous. There must be another way. This is the only way, Doctor. Remember the last time we we survived. Yes, Kronos saved us. But that but this won't be easy. Unless, unless what? Unless K9 can 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 hold can save us. Kronos he he's the most powerful god. He 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 saved us from. Uh, when we when we say when we stop the master, we can use K9 as a as a di as a deer counter, and then he can and then we can hold then he can hold the timelines and together, and then the titles will be the two titles will release. Yes, but there's only one thing: the, the time round had to only work one one of the, one of the, the titles. Yes, like, yes, I I know what you mean. We need. Well, well, is there a choice, Doctor? Your TARDIS or my TARDIS? Well, your TARDIS. Oh, yes, my way. Anyway, what do you think about TARDIS? Oh, well, it's a room. Oh, great. Well, well next time, I'm going to bring back the round things. Right. Hold on, pick the round thing somewhere. I never used it for a while. Ah, oh, there it is. There's that, sin that silver button. If I press it, two TARDISes will be will both be late waited. K9, can you do? Can you hold the TARDIS uh, uh, for a while? Everybody, master. Okay. Here it goes. Phew. Doctor, how are you? I'm fine. Looks like two TARDISes are back to where they were. Well, see ya. Bye bye, Shaw. Uh, Doctor. Let me guess. Your TARDIS is not here. Yes. Great. 
Well, all because of the timeline and the two tardis are separate, that means your tardis is floating somewhere in the vortex. It could be anywhere and any when. Well, I guess you're stuck with me now. We can both stop the ice words together. Well, I can handle it myself. I'm the one. Oh, sorry. Uh, you were saying? Well, as I'm saying, I can handle the ice words by myself. No, I can help you, because you. Well, I know you caused them trying to stop their home planet's destruction, but I can help you. Please. Okay then. Yay! Sorry, I will do that again. Anyway, now, let's find the ice world ship. Oh, what? Sorry, in the vortex. I think it must, they must have uh, fallen from the vortex, meaning they could be anywhere. Oh, look. It's a, it's a stress signal from the ice world ship. Let's see where it came from. Aha! According to research, it's... It looks like the signal is coming from somewhere on Earth. Doesn't say what year or when. Let's go there, shall we? Right. Hold on tight. Right, Doctor, you had to stay here. Excuse me? Well, I can't let you go out there on your own, Doctor. Besides, it, it, there's ice words out there. Whatever's out there, whatever's gonna happen to you, I can't let you put you in danger. I'm the only one who can go out there, those doors. I'm your future. So I'm... I'm the one who has to protect you. If everything happens to you, it can also affect my future. And also can affect my past. What am I supposed to do when you're out there? I don't know! Eat some jelly babies or read a book or something! Anyway, I'll be fine. Are you sure you'll be alright? I'm okay! It's Christmas! What the puppy go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's cold. Because it, it this is, it's, this is, it's, it's, I think it's December, because it's Christmas. Merry Christmas. Uh, anyway, now, uh, can I borrow your scarf? I think it's getting cold out there. All right, but you better take care. It's I got a cost a fortune for that scarf. Promise you, Doctor. I'll I'll bring it back. Now I need I need to get a change. Now you just uh, wait here then. <coughs> okay. This is Earth. Well, it looks like Earth, but because it's a town, banded. This is a Christmas. There's some Christmas decorations. So, it must be December, so where are all the people? There could be pe people out there, it could be Christmas Eve. It is Earth. But where is everyone? This place is like a ghost town. Where are the ice wears? <laughs> My scarf is a furry. What's happened here? Like no one's about. Hello? Hello? Merry Christmas? Happy Easter? <laughs> See? No one around. Just no, no people. Cars past here. People can't go disappear outside. It's it it's too. How how can people disappear? Ah, 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 Who are you? Right, well, I hope I may introduce myself. Uh, my name is Max Max Dillon, and I'm sorry I tried to grab you. Um, I was a. Uh, I thought you were ice wear. Well, at least I'd run. Oh, and don't mind the uh, uh, army mask. I have, uh, may have run from the ice swords and they blast my half of my face. Mind me, in two face. You two. Anyway, where am I? Is this your house? Anyway, this is. I hope this is Earth. But tell me, what year is this? Oh, I must. I lost track years ago. How do you know what year is it? I mean, you got a Christmas tree. I guess you know it is Christmas. 
Christmas. And every day is Christmas. Do you know where you were born? I must be born somewhere 2004 or 2005. I don't know. So you were born somewhere in 2004 or 2005. So, mate, look here. I think you were 17. I think it's... Oh, well, I can count the years. I think it's 2023 or 2024. Oh. Oh, yes. Yes, I know what you mean. The Ice Warriors. I have to go. Go, you can't go out there. It's dangerous. The Ice Warriors will come after you. Look, I'm sorry. I have to go. It's just something is going to happen here on Earth 2023. You see, my past is, well, your future. Goodbye. Of course, how'd I forget? Earth was invaded back in 2023. The Ice Warriors, they must have already been falling the vortex. I can't change this now, this is a fixed point in time. Earth wants to be invaded. I have to fix this. First, I must find the weapon, but... I know you showed up. You are the doctor! No, I'm the doctor. Oh, it's the scarf. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah, I just borrowed from him. From Earth. It, so you must have started the war in, on January, January the first, two thousand and twenty-three, New Year's Eve. But, but New Year's Day. But but why? Why? Why did you start this war? Huh? Is it because you want to strap me so I can give you the artifact? Look, I know what my other self did to you, but it's but that but that was a mistake. He want he wanted to release your your, your kind from from ice, but. But if you do that, your, your species will melt. Mars will die. But I'm sorry. But I know you have... I know you've slept for Mars for 5,000 years, but... But I'm sorry. This is the only chance you have. No. We must survive. If you do not give us Doctor, then you must die. Say thank you. Doctor? Ah, that's Bert. Hello, Doctor. I've got my screwdriver. Oh, I see. You really need to check some spares. Anyway, now, where is everyone? And where are we? Come in, come in the TARDIS and I'll explain to you. Well, perhaps you could explain me. Explain you what? Hmm? What happened out there? What was out there? It's your future, I can't tell you. Besides, I read it must have helped us inside was at the time war. The what? The time war. It, uh, you won't explain. It's your future. When I was at, when I was there, I read something about, about Earth. See how it happened. I was busy saving Gallifrey until suddenly I read something. Something terrible. What? The Ice Warriors. They came to Earth on January the 1st, 2023. Until... Well, I guess is that, that out there must be Christmas Eve, 2023. But what happens in Christmas Eve, 2023? What happens? I can't tell you. Well, I'm going to forget soon if you take me back to my own timeline to so tell me. The Ice Wars, they launched the artifact. Through 25 miles from the Earth. Until then, Earth was melt. But, 
Why? Why do they want to launch um, uh, the artifact from, Mar from Earth? They wanted to launch it from Mars, but why Earth? They want to make Earth as Mars, but till then, they it failed. The icebergs failed. Until the Earth melted. Nothing uh, ever happened. The mel it melted and it was destroyed. I remember that because I was you. But when I told you, I've forgotten. When I wanted to know the truth, when I, I was at the Time War, I read what happened, what you, what I happened, what you told me happened, what I told you now. The Earth was melted. It was the truth. I, I saw it. I can't. Forgive it, and then I saw it melted. And the ice was, they died in a broken heart, and their ship was destroyed. They got nothing left now. Mars was dead, and Earth was destroyed. They got nothing left. They blamed themselves to destroy the universe. But no, it can't be. We can go back and change it. Doctor, you know what happens. If we go back and change it, time will rip itself apart. 2023 is a fixed point in time. Besides, Earth was was melted then. But I went there in my ninth generation from the Time War. It. I saw it melted. There was nothing. There was nothing. Absolutely nothing. We can still try. We can't. I went back there and there was nothing. No earth. Just the sky. Just the clouds. Wait. Clouds? Yeah? So? You said about clouds. You mean the earth. You said the clouds. Yes, I did. How was that earth? It was melted. Then how do you know it was melted? Look, if you didn't know the earth was melted, it means means the clouds were, were black in you, so that means you can't see properly. You do have a point. It means if the earth was was not melted, it means it means it's still alive. Oh yes. Yes of course oh, Why have I forgetting? When I was at Earth, when I was when I was with my knife incarnation, I didn't see anything. Just clouds. I thought Earth was melted when I read the book. Earth was melted, but one of the book was wrong. Maybe that book was a fixed point in time. What if that book was meant to say, tell me if Earth was melted? Maybe you and me were, were, to, were together for a reason. We had to save Earth. But how? Like, like I said, if 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 the Ice Warriors launched the artifact right over the sky. We have any reason to catch it. Whoever's, whoever's on that TARDIS will melt or die. But it's it's dangerous. But the wizards have a chance. But if if we launch the let me guess, if we launch the artifact somewhere where it's not from Earth, well, maybe we can launch it somewhere a habited planet. Exactly. Then, and no one, and the, and the Earth will be safe, or melted. But there's only one thing, the icebergs are still on, on Earth. Yes, but the, if, if we give, if the icebergs go, the, the, go after the artifact, if they trace its location, they notice the, the, the artifact is destroyed, then they notice the artifact is gone. So they have no way to bring back Mars. But it's a risk I have to take. Good. We have, we have to go, we have to go somewhere near a planet, somewhere it, it's not habited. It is habited, but I know one planet, Magada. This is the only planet we can have to take. Right. Right, set the call back to Earth. And on Christmas morning, 2025, I mean 2023. Well, it's a risk we have to take. Hold on tight, Doctor. Oh, and uh, you better catch the artifact from your scarf. It's the easy way. Right. Here we go. <laughs> Mm, 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 mm. 
Right. In the sky now. We can... I can see what the ice worms are doing. Ah, oh, yes. They open the breach from the artifact. It's launching. Right. Doctor, open the doors. Wait, I'll open it for you. Right. Well, now catch it with your scarf. I got it, Doctor. Right, now chuck it away. I, I, I locked it the nearest planet, or ha habitable planet. <clears throat> okay, now. All right. Right. Sorry, Ice Wars. Your weapon's gone. Bye bye. <clears throat> Ah, we did it! Yes, we did! Anyway, Earth is safe now, and uh, and the Earth has been has, has been safe once and for. <laughs> but what about the Ice Warriors? Oh, I, I'll give a message to in the bog off, and it's Christmas. Hope they give him a strat him help. Anyway, I think we should celebrate. It's Christmas anyway. Or. What if it snows? We'll make it snow on Earth. Let's watch, shall we? Happy uh, uh, Christmas of 2023. Yes, indeed so. <laughs> In that case, we should celebrate anyway. Yes, indeed so. Yes! That also beats on AE, isn't it? Oh, and uh, what about me? Oh, yes! Back to your, back to your timeline, long ago. Right, to 1976. Back. Goodbye, Doctor. Merry Christmas. You too, Doctor. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, and take care of Sarah Jane, will you? I will. Bye-bye! And a Merry Christmas! Ah, here we are. I miss you, old girl. Doctor? Ah, hello, Sarah. Sorry, I was, I was someone else. What happened? Where are the ice warriors? Well, uh, I'll explain later. Anyway, now, off to the Brigadier. Christmas dinner, tell him the Christmas dinner is on. <sighs> I never get myself old. Now I must get back to Earth, protected. Ho, ho, ho! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Doctor, and a Happy New Year. <laughs>